In this video, we are going to cover centralization and decentralization in an organization. What is centralization? Basically, uh, a centralized organization is where all the decision making is concentrated at the topmost level, that is the strategy apex, strategical apex, as discussed previously in uh, the hierarchy level, the Minsberg level of organization. So, a centralized organization is the one where the authority is concentrated at one place. Uh, the centralization can be in two ways, geographical or authoritative. It could be geographically centralized. Uh, that means that the organization is located at one place and authoritatively centralized. That means all the scene making has, uh, be, is taken at one position. Uh, wherever the organization's offices are located or dispersed. So there are different disadvantages or, and advantages of centralization or decentralization. Centralization offer greater control over an organization and greater coordination because it's a top-down approach. The information is flown from top level to the bottom level to this from the strategic apex level to the operating core level so uh, all the tasks are driven from top level whereas the decentralization the decentralized model offers more flexibility in decisions because uh, the scene making in or influence of the scene making is held at the middle management level uh, and i have prepared a table that will look after and of certain advantages and disadvantages of the two so these are the arguments in favor and in, in against centralization or decentralization. So decisions are made at one point. Number one, senior managers can take a wider view of problems and consequences and can report to the topmost level uh, with respect to each decision. Senior management can balance the interest of different functions among each other quality of decisions is theoretically higher because of skills and experience of the management. It is possibly cheaper by reducing the number of managers required and so requires lower cost of overheads because everything is being decided at one level. So there is not a lot of requirement of more number of managers. Crisis decisions are taken more quickly because this decision making is concentrated at one point. If the issue is delegated to different portions or different functions, crisis decisions will be delayed definitely. The policies, procedures and documentation can be standardized organization-wide in all the departments of functions. There will be uh, unified policies and therefore no employees of different cross functions would be in a disagreement with one another or uh, would not be demotive because of incentives of one against and other departments uh, incentives however there are certain disadvantages of centralization which can be called advantages of delegation or decentralizations which are it avoids overburdening of top managers because the most of things are not concentrated over there and uh, if the model is centralized the workload and stress is quite higher it improves the motivation of more junior workers because of their involvement the greater awareness of local problem by decision makers because uh, if uh, at a centralization centralized approach centralized in organization the awareness of local problems is not up up to that level where the local or regional area management makes the decisions usually the speed of decision making is quicker because of changing events and appear a live appearance at the site uh, if it's geographically decentralized or delegated it helps develop the skills of junior managers especially this decision making skills and risk taking abilities which supports the manager's succession Separate spheres of responsibility can be easily identified, that is control, performance measure and accountability. They all are better. Function-wise reporting or the product-wise accountability is usually easier and better. However, if all the decisions are centralized, the accountability would not be 
that much easier. Communication technology allows the decisions to be made locally with information and input from head office is required. So I think this is it for it. So thank you very much. Take care. Goodbye.